Hi you guys, I'm here today to taste test Lenny and Larry's The Complete Cookie. This is a chocolate chipped cookie that has no eggs, no dairy, no soy, no GMO, and it's vegan. Right here. And you can see all the things it doesn't have at the top. It lists them, makes it very clear. I've seen these a lot of places. A lot of people really like these cookies, but I have yet to try one. So, I thought this morning would be an excellent time to see what it's all about. It smells nice. It is kind of broken up. I tried to find one at the store that wasn't felt like it was broken, but all of them kind of felt like they had been broken. Ooh, it's a thick cookie too. Look how thick that is. Wow. All right. Here we go. Lenny's and Larry's chocolate chip. Mm. It's a soft cookie. Texture is a little bit unusual. It dissolves really quickly. I'm guessing because of the, I don't know if it's because of the fiber or the protein. There's 16 grams of protein in here. So maybe they do like a protein powder or something in their mix. And that's the texture issue that I'm coming across. Hmm. The taste is, is fine. The texture is just kind of weird. It's almost like, um, it's almost the texture of a dried out cake. It has more of a cakey texture than a cookie texture. But it's not like a super moist. I mean, it's not super dry cookie, but... Because you know crunch factor. And it is very chocolatey chippy. As you can see, it is loaded. But yeah, I don't know if I would get these again. I got a few of the other flavors. I bought one of each flavor they had at the store, so we'll see if the other flavors have the same texture. But yeah, taste is okay, but I don't know if I would ever buy this again just because of the texture. Let me know if you've ever tried a Bunny and Larry's cookie. If you have, let me know what you thought of it in the comment section below. Let me know what flavor you found and that you tried. And, uh, hmm. Yeah, they do have a website, of course. I'll make sure and put a link below to that. But, yeah. I don't know if I would be a repeat customer. At least of this one. Like I said, I'm going to try the other flavors. See how I feel about those. But I personally don't think I'd be repurchasing this. And um, I would recommend it to others, though, that are looking for a vegan cookie that don't have texture issues. But I have a lot of texture issues. So anytime a texture is a bit unusual, then... Oftentimes it uh, ruins the experience for me of the food. So um, I definitely would say give these a try if you haven't, because maybe it'll be something that you'll you know find to be just fine and not have a texture issue with. Um, yeah. But all right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next review.